<laughs> On Sunday, Jack Evans and George Harris celebrated their 53rd anniversary. We have been in our relations since January the 19th of 1961. They celebrate the day they met, not the day they got married, because, well, they can't get married. For years, the two men have said they'll wait until they can legally get married in their church, Dallas's North Haven United Methodist. We've always wanted to get married in Texas. And I don't know if we're going to live long enough. Uh, we're way past due. Inspired by couples like Evans and Harris, North Haven's emeritus pastor, Bill McIlvaney, announced he will begin performing same-sex weddings. Probably should have done it a long time ago. The weddings will take place at two neighboring churches. The United Methodist Church's rules don't allow same-sex weddings. The weddings won't be recognized by the state of Texas or the Methodist Church, but they will be performed in the same way as an opposite-sex wedding. What we might call a religious service with appropriate biblical and theological language, uh, just like a wedding that they ordinarily would have. Because McIlvaney is retired, he's not sure if there will be any repercussions for his decision. An official spokeswoman for the United Methodist Church refused to comment for this story. North Haven's senior pastor, Eric Folkerth, says he fully supports McIlvaney's decision. The United Methodists are deeply out of step on this right now. But unless the church finds a way to stop McIlvaney, Evans and Harris will finally have the chance to have their relationship blessed by a Methodist pastor. And maybe they'll also get a new anniversary. 53 years is time to celebrate and um, be blessed by a minister.